twin. Where have you been? <laughs> Much, much bigger than I expected. I got another page. This is my new stand. Mm -hmm. This Valentine's Day sucks. Her is on nine. This a little too much for y'all. This Valentine's Day, I want to give you that's what you really want. want. Yeah, that's freaky. We're done today. Good morning. Tell y'all welcome to another vlog. My life is all over the place. I'm about to get a sense of some type of stability so I feel like I can be my best self. If y'all haven't already, you need to head over and watch my life update. When it comes to my moving that I was supposed to make in January, I got approved for a place and then I got denied. I don't know how that worked. You may say, how do you get approved and denied? I don't know. That kind of discouraged me a little bit. In the midst of it all, I'm like, let me try and get somewhat comfortable. Go to our apartments and do this and do that. I haven't made myself comfortable here at all. And I'm sure y'all can tell by the background of my videos. My stepdad's man cave is mine now. For the time being, just temporarily. It's mainly so I can kind of get some sense of home. Because I haven't felt at home in a long time. It's used to a certain look and it's not even about a look for y'all it's more so a look for me it makes me wake up and be happy clutter my things aren't thrown in boxes and in tubs i can't live like that and that's how i've been living like for the past couple of months because i've been anticipating this move but i haven't been actively making any moves towards it if it makes sense the more freedom to do that without my mind constantly being on i gotta move next week i gotta move this you know i got 30 days to move i got 25 days you know so it's not ideal it's not ideal but it's not a stressful situation like, i make a lot of impulsive decisions see exactly what it is that jada wants because jada will get a thought in her mind and then she'll be like yeah this is what we doing a few days later a couple months later it's like i made the wrong decision i should have you know and i don't like living my life like that because there's so many things in life that i wish i could have done differently I have the opportunity now to sit and dwell sit and think sit and travel and analyze everything around me and decide exactly what it is that i want out of my life i'm gonna do it so today we have already moved pretty much everything downstairs so basically the room that i was in downstairs we finna do a stretch of room because this room is much bigger so that will serve this will kind of serve as like a bedroom and a studio see how big this room is it's really really big You can't even seem to, you, you really can't take it all in, but it's big. And so, so I basically have an idea of how I want to set the room up. Again, we still have to move stuff around. The bulk of it last night. I said I had to work early in the morning, so we didn't do everything. But I got this tall dresser. It was about a thousand dollars. And it came built. It's really, really heavy and it's good quality. Oh. Oh, I gotta find out how to open it. The screws on the inside, so I'm gonna have to flip them with my, with my screwdriver, but it's really cute. My goal today is to basically get everything upstairs, my bed together, my vanity. That is downstairs, let me show y'all. All my stuff is in here. We got all my stuff. Well, not all my stuff, but we got the stuff that I'm gonna use in the room. Majority of like my beauty room stuff, my vanity right here is so freaking big. I ordered a new vanity desk from Impressions and then my full body mirror. A little nightstand. See how all my stuff is just jumbled up in this room? Like, uh, it wasn't like this, but it, it's just, it, I can't do it no more. So he moved all his stuff in here. It, it's really needed for my sanity. I expected January and February to go completely different. Okay, so the dresser came with it flipped. So now I have to screw all the the gold jar pulls. <laughs> I gotta screw these in. So this is where I got the this is where I got it from. Toe furniture. Don't be boring. I love their aesthetic. It's like pink and black. I love that. The jackpot by finding this. I've been eyeing this for a long time, and it's y'all. They struggled so bad bringing it upstairs. I felt so bad. It was 
so heavy and any furniture that's heavy you know it's good quality and any furniture better yet any furniture that comes already built you know it's solid it's not messing up ever so i'm gonna have this forever so i'm glad i made the investment in their place. I'm about to take this off the wall. I guess that'll help. I want to make it as least possible work for my stepdad when he get home. It's downstairs. Cause it's like glass. I don't want to break it. We got a lot of work to do. We got a lot, a lot of work to do. But I'm built for it. Twin, where have you been? <laughs> I haven't vlogged in like two weeks. It's just been, I don't know, but it's very refreshing to be back on camera. I have a couple of things that I'm about to do. I know y'all probably looking at my setup. Y'all probably like, what's going on? Now it is February 13th. I'm about to get out of the house. I kind of been in the house every day for the past, for the past like, Probably like three days. I woke up one morning and my tire was flat. So I have to get a new tire. That's literally a brand new tire. So I don't understand why it's flat, but I must have ran over something, must have hit something or whatever because it is literally flat on the ground. But that kind of had me upset and just a lot of other things that time of the month coming. It's just been a lot of things that kind of had me like, I don't want to do nothing. I'm in my feels. But all that is going to be covered again in the life update. So I don't know if that's going to be before or after this video. But like I said, y'all are going to know everything about everything. A couple errands to run today. Fun stuff that I'm doing, which is why I decided to pick up the camera and go ahead and do a little vlog. Today is the day for V-Day. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. I don't have no plans for tomorrow. I think I'm going to just cook for myself and do like a face mask and just relax and parlay around the crib. But anyways, today, which is Tuesday, I am about to go pick up a grocery order. Home goods perhaps because I'm looking for an accent pillow, like a really cute accent pillow. I got to take a picture of my bed before I go so I can see exactly where it's going to go. But I do need an accent pillow. I go by my storage. I have a couple things to just throw in there. I've been going by the storage a lot lately. My little brother swear he not going on a date tomorrow, but he like he gotta he gotta buy his Valentine a gift. I told him if y'all going to the movies on Valentine's Day, that's a date. He's like, nah, that's not a date. So I'm like, okay, cool. Fuck y'all heads off. I'm about to get myself together, and then I'm gonna come holler at y'all when I am somewhat together, cause time is ticking and I gotta go. So I'm all dressed. I just got my all pink. Very me. Um, nothing major because I'm just running errands. Pretty little thing, sweats, Uggs, MCM bag. This shirt that says I made fetch happen and this little hoodie from from Target. But yeah, ain't much going on, y'all. My room is a mess. I gotta fold all those clothes up and put them in the dresser. That's why they're on the floor. But I think I'm good. I only gotta go pick up some stuff. I gotta go pick, I gotta pick up order at Walmart and I gotta pick up order at Kroger. I'm gonna go to Walmart first because I was supposed to pick it up yesterday. But yeah, I'm gonna head out. At the gas station, my tank was literally on E. I had like 8% worth of gas. I don't know how many miles that is, but it's a 8%. It, it's funny that my car like tell me like it's a phone or something. It'd be like 8%, 13%. 20% I look really orange it's gonna be about let's see if I can guess so my tank was completely empty I'll say like 90 it's at 66 right now we'll see what it is but yeah I'm about to go pick up some stuff from Walmart I was supposed to go get it yesterday but I kind of had a panic attack because my tire was flat but surprisingly it hasn't went back down so I don't think I have a leak I don't know what caused my tire to go flat but it was flat so I guess we'll see 84 six dollars short not too shabby <laughs> yeah. well y'all they haven't texted me and said that my groceries are ready from Kroger so I'm gonna go handle oh shit ah 
so I'm leaving Walmart. I don't know if y'all can really see me, but Kroger hasn't texted me that my groceries are ready, and that's where like my real groceries are. Go ahead home and get my brother, and then do all the things that I have to do, and then come back home on this side of town and get the groceries because the grocery store is literally like five minutes from the house. So that's probably what I'll do. That way I won't feel like I'm running around because I would have had to wait like 20 minutes on Kroger if they be ready on time, which they probably won't be. So I'm just making them wait on me. <laughs> I'm back home. I what I ordered from Walmart. Nothing major. I ordered some paint supplies because when my stepdad takes his TV down, I'm gonna have to patch it up because that's the wall that my name sign is gonna go on. Just some more washcloths because I need some. It's like my washcloths going missing. So I'm gonna wash these first before I use them. Needed some more of those. Why you only buy white? I don't know, I only like white. Got some hole filler, some paint brushes. Handy dandy tie. I've been needing some new detergent. Some green tea pods for my Keurig. I really, really wanna get into drinking tea before bed because I noticed that when I'm drinking stuff and I drink tea before I go to sleep, it always calms me down and helps me sleep better. So I got this green tea, body oil, got me some more Dow. Like, don't like Dow, but I personally like Dow for my first soap. I like to use like an antibacterial soap. And I go in with like a creamy moisturizing soap. Some Olipop and some, and some little stuff. So I'm gonna put this in my little mini fridge. I had another mini fridge. I don't know if y'all remember when I bought my mini fridge from Target, the bigger one. But I don't wanna put it in this room. Cause I feel like it won't look cute in here. So I just got my little small pink one, but we gonna put this in here. Back at my storage, um, I just loaded everything in here. I need some pictures for my room. I have these. I feel like these tie everything in really good. I just wish they were framed. So I wonder if I can buy like a big frame to put this in. I don't know. Well, we gonna take them. Inside. I go to my storage like once a week. But y'all see how much stuff in here? It's so hard to go through it. I've literally packed it with so much crap. I've been on the empty mines. I should have kept on through. pillow it gotta be like oh look at that big old pillow it gotta be like gold or pink flower on that pillow i don't really like that it's too big i need a small one i think we need like a cream pillow to tie all the cream in because my bedding is white and then like the rest is Hey guys, we're going to Walmart with Loverboy. This is so funny. He got to find his Valentine a little gift. No way. Mm. <laughs> Take that out. Oh my God. We might be candy from the regular house. Oh Jesus. Excuse me. Excuse me. This Valentine's Day, I want to give you that what you really want. Life. Finally give that one. Yeah, that's freaky. Get it to the last minute. Bracelets, little necklace, bear, cute little bear. We going with a pink gold and yeah, like a pink and gold thing. Heavily influenced by the Jada Jone, but we ain't gonna talk about that, let's go. Okay, we might can get her some lip gloss. She's a girl, girls like lip gloss. So I'm back home. This is what we got. I got some brown eggs. I never had brown eggs before, have you? I have. 
They say they better for you. Green beans, romaine for my salad, another smoothie mix, strawberries, wheat bread for my toast, Greek yogurt, zero sugar juice for my smoothies, ice cream sandwiches when I wanna cheat but not really cheat, and pure lemon. This thing that I've been doing when I've been dieting so I can stay away from sugar is I'll mix lemon juice, water, and use Splenda, and it tastes just like lemonade. Some salmon. I'm gonna cook one of these tomorrow, so I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna leave this out. Bananas. I got two bags of these oranges. Y'all know how I feel about these oranges. Sweet potatoes, cucumbers, tomatoes, Cheerios, pure honey. I got a cob salad. Starting things off right. I did get fried, but but these fast food salads be huge. Like, it be way too much in these salads for me to eat. I'm transferring it to a bowl because I'm not going to be able to eat all this. Grocery store, seeing everybody, like, all the big balloons and the flower bouquets. Like, this is my first, like, Valentine's Day without, I'm not even texting nobody. <laughs> I'm not getting no flowers. I can buy myself flowers. Molly said it the best. It's a lonely girl V day. I'm not mad though. It's peaceful. It's a little too peaceful. Uh, repair mask. Bracelet. It says, "Love yourself." So cute. Got a package. Let's see, let's see, let's see what's inside of her. Y'all, it's so much bubble wrap. She she knows, she knows what she's doing. There's no way it could get broken in transit. Much, much bigger than I expected. Didn't know it was wooden on the back. I love that. So it'll last. It's gonna hold up really well. I got some Etsy. Jade. Oh, I bought this little honey pot from RJ for my tea. So this is the honey that I have, 100% pure, raw, and unfiltered. This is so cool. Got these organizers for my vanity desk. Impression sent me the wrong vanity desk, but I went ahead and put it together. I don't know how they about to go about it because they sent me the wrong thing and I put it together and now they want me to send it back and I'm like, just, I just want to tell them, like, reimburse me for the difference of what I got because I'm not finna go through all that. Y'all see, I got a big mess. I'm putting all my clothes in my dresser. I have athleisure. So this is, like, all my little athleisure sets. I would prefer all of my undergarments to go in one drawer, but as y'all see, my bras are huge, so I don't think that's gonna work. I have denim in here, but I think I'm gonna take those out and put those in the closet. I gotta wait on him to take his TV down and then I'm gonna put it up. But I'm just organizing. But yeah, I think I'm definitely gonna take these jeans out because it's really like crowded in there and I have a lot of jeans. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Yo, my pajama drawer is over capacity, literally. 
you know, you want to open. But now I'm about to do my skims and wait a minute, Joy. Good morning. Happy Valentine's Day. I know I look crazy, but I'm going to finish this mess I made and I'm going to start my day. It is 10.38, so my goal is to be finished with this by 12. Yeah, so I need to hurry up. I mean, I think I actually like this camera. I'm going to just use this for backup. Like, just in case. Because I'm about to record. I'm going to show y'all the difference between where the camera's at. This is way more zoomed out. And the Sony is, like, right in my face. I think I'm going to stick to this one. I'm eating a snack. Carrots and oranges. I've been working all day. You really can't tell. But I just been organizing. That's why it don't really look like much. But I got all my stuff in the room. Everything is in the dresser. I've been doing laundry. And now I can just chill. I'm about to take a shower. Um, I'm going to do myself a little pajama night. Probably watch TV. Eat. Nothing major going on for me today. I'm in a room full of windows. It's four big windows over there. So it's just going to motivate me so I can stop being so lazy. I'm glad we switched rooms because it's just overall brighter. The other room I was in, it was literally at the bottom of the house. It was the only bedroom downstairs. It was like in the corner in the back of the house. So you got to know it was only one window. It was really dark in there, dim in there. So I hated it. I so much stuff. And like I said, when I moved, my goal was not to be here over a month. Really over like two months. But I graduated late. And everything just didn't align exactly in my mind how I thought it would. Which I don't even know how to assume i will be able to do that, 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 that fast. But I thought I could pull it off. And then so it went from October to December. And then I was like, I'm a new vlogmas. So it turned into January. And now, I'm not really pressed. I just want to be comfortable. I'll come back to y'all when something exciting is happening. My freaking drill is dead. And I don't know what the charger is. I gotta use a red. I do not feel like cooking. I'm trying to think about what I could eat. I'll cook tomorrow. I'm trying to do a pickup. And it say no slots available. I'm about to go and get me some food. This is my pajamas for tonight. Here's the Tika tour. Can you see like the writing on them? So cute. Just got back home. I got Italian. So got the rigatoni martino with chicken. These are salad. And this is my ding ding. Another package. I know exactly what it is. It's a new perfume stand. Cause I feel like the one I had was kind of childish. Not childish, but it was like outdated. If y'all can tell, but you really can't see. I'm going for more, more modern glam versus glam glam. So I still want it to be like, y'all see I had the sparkle pillow, but I don't want it to be like glammed out anymore. Like I used to have a lot of like bling, I don't want a lot of bling bling. I kind of want it to be, you know, y'all get what I'm saying. The girls, they get it, get it. I want it to be very, very pretty in here and like my next home. But I don't want it to be like flashy. I want you to come in and it just be aesthetically pleasing to the eye. Versus it being like basically childish. So the one I had was cute. But sometimes that diamond, like that bling can look really cheap. And I just got this little clear one. Because you can never go wrong with clear. But how does it... How does she sit? Okay. So it's going to sit like this. It's going to be like a display. Love that. I don't even think I got enough perfume for this. But nonetheless, it's going to be cute. So it comes with all the tools. I 
be careful with this new glass top thing because I am very, very clumsy and my new vanity literally has glass on the top. If they send it to you, it probably won't be hard to replace the glass, but who wants to do that? When we move my mirror up here, I realized that it's actually broken on the right side, which you can't see it because I kind of covered it. Since vanity stuff is really expensive and to just be breaking it and letting it break and stuff is kind of insane. So I really want to, I really, really want to take care of it. So then it came with like some little plastic rubber, whatever. And that goes on the bottom, I guess not to scrape up the furniture. My little brother out on his little date. I wonder how it's going. I wonder if she like her gift. I bet that's his girlfriend. He's trying to play her to the left. I hope she don't watch my YouTube because she don't be like, that line. <laughs> Let, me <stop. laughs> Let me get out the key business. Okay. This is my new stand. And I think I'm going to put her on my dresser. I already got two things on here. I don't want to overcrowd it. It's kind of the only place it can go. how we gonna do it i don't know how i feel about this right here but yeah so these are almost all empty so i'm just gonna take these off because there's really no room for them i love my prada bottle though maybe prada can go up there but this is near empty it's almost empty so yeah go live and chat with the girls in the room and everybody asking questions so i think i'm gonna do a life update first but he gotta move that before i do it because i want my name to be up I'm gonna transfer over to TikTok Live. I've been out here talking to them for at least an hour. But I'm about to get off here and get ready to head my bed. I'm finna book me a hair appointment. Um and yeah, well I'm gonna eat the rest of my pasta even though I don't need to be eating, but I need to try and eat my pasta before it turns 12. But yeah, we had a nice little night. This Valentine's Day sucked. But it was peaceful. But I know I'm gonna probably be sad once I get on TikTok. I know I'm gonna be sad. <laughs> once I start scrolling, <laughs> I'll be on your sad. But yeah, it's okay. It's okay. But yeah, y'all. Happy Saturday. I know I abandoned y'all, but I just got a spurge of energy. Today is like my second came on the other day, so y'all know I'll be kind of out of it for the first two to three days just got some motivation and i just want to be better ah it's just so hard when you want so much like my brain will explode trying to think about all the things that i want to do and it like stresses me out not it, let it be counterproductive because it will be very counterproductive i literally do nothing instead so i'm trying to get up I feel like, I think is I feel like I have to be doing something every day for me to entertain y'all. And I really don't. I really think about what it is that I want to do, what it is that I want to convey. Clean up. Nobody's home, so I may try to film my life update. But knowing the way my luck is, somebody's going to end up coming by the time I get done getting ready. So I may or may not film that today, but I am going to get out of bed and do something with myself. My nails and toes aren't done. I get those done this week. I'm so close to 300K. I'm trying to decide what I want to do. I took pictures for 300K. I took pictures, but that was going on a year ago. So I don't even want to post those anymore. So I got to figure that out. But I'm about to clean my room. Well, it's not really messy. I got to fold some stuff. So we finna get that done. I'm going to cook. I got a wig I got to put on. Chinese holiday is it's over with i think so now i gotta really get back to work i kind of been lollygagging i want so much and there's so many goals that i have to reach and it's like jada you're not gonna reach those goals if you're just doing nothing every day like so many days have went by that i've done nothing and i make excuses like oh i'm on my cycle next day next day like no 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 get it done make yourself proud make yourself happy because i'm the happiest when I'm consistent when I'm flourishing, when I'm blossoming. So we finna, we finna come up out of this little funk.
it's pretty big it's not the biggest it's not as big as my closet i had before but i don't have all my clothes and stuff out either those are still in storage most of them we go nowhere anyways i said i'll just rotate my clothes every couple of weeks or whatever glamma is all of my hygiene products i have hella hygiene products and i have hella towels and washcloths if i'm being honest i don't really want to put them in the linen closet because these are my washcloths and towels from my house white and, and light colored and i just don't want the general public to use them like this is how everything is arranged so i have like right here this is like all my extras so i got like extra body sprays extra micellar water all this this is why i've been trying to tell myself tell myself not to buy a lot of stuff if i'm not out because i always have a surplus oh i'm just gonna get two just for when i run out no i'm gonna start buying stuff when i need it versus buying multiples and having it just stored somewhere because that just takes up space odorant and lotion let's sit that right well this is on here because i don't use that every day my scrub white towels and white cloths it just make me feel like a hotel so like i never really bought like dark colored towels i probably have like i think i have like three pink towels and i really specifically use those like when i'm on my cycle just because you know safer i never did anything with my flowers so i'm about to now i'm just gonna take these water bottles that i had sitting up here and pour water <laughs> inside of the plant and I got this vase from Home Goods. Let me show y'all. It's so cute. Pink. But yeah, y'all know what I told y'all about roses. I really want to start buying myself some weekly. So now that I have like a more organized place to be, I'm really going to be keeping up with it every week. I really want to see how long I can let them live. Like if I can really take care of them to the point where they don't die. I cut all the leaves off like I usually do. Because I feel like when I cut all the leaves off, it make it look kind of too bare. So I'm going to just cut like a few and leave some. I didn't cut all the greenery because I feel like it makes it look too bare. So we're going to see how long these live. They've been holding up pretty well. But yeah. My roses. It's 4.50. I'm going to try and do a quick little makeup look. My goal is to be done by like 5.30 so I can really quickly record this video. I really want to film a little TikTok of me getting ready as well. So, yep. I'm going to set that up. I'm going to record a TikTok and then hopefully nobody gets here by the time I'm getting ready to record my life update. Alright y'all, so I just finished filming and now I'm finna go live just very fast just to talk to them just so they can see this hairstyle because I'm about to take it out. I feel very accomplished because I filmed a TikTok, I edited a TikTok and I posted it. I filmed it with my Sony. I think I like the quality for TikToks. I feel like I'm going to use that like when I want to make short form content because I really like how it came out. But yeah, we about to go live. Okay, so I'm going to cook some salmon, some green beans, and some red potatoes. I think I need you. I swear it's time to keep these feelings to myself. Now you're the one I'm thinking of. My higher grandma, I get love. For gravity, I'd rather stay up here. We can get away. Palm cheese, peach fuels on the night day All I wanna hear is the differences that we play Sit right next to you, you I'm done, I'm cooking
cooking. It's the food. Salmon and roasted potatoes. Now, what I will say is the green beans smelled like throw up when I took them out of the pack. They're supposed to be like garlic parmesan, like pre-made, but they really, really stink. I think those have freezer burn. The potatoes are good, just a little over seasoned. All right, y'all, so I'm about to take a bath. I wanted to ask y'all though, have y'all tried the period diapers? Because I tried them last month and I actually really like them sleeping. I think they're really comfy. So Jada approved. I definitely think y'all should try these. I gotta figure out the cooking situation though. Cause I don't know if I'm gonna be able to cook every day. I don't know if I'm gonna wanna cook every day. And I don't feel like I'm the best cook. Believe it to me, I'll be eating salads for dinner and lunch. I am out the shower and while PJ'd up. I'm about to do my teeth whitening thing before I go to sleep. I bought this months and months and months ago and I never completed the treatment. It came with, I think it came with five and I only use one. So I'm about to try to use this consistently every day and see what change I see in my teeth. Cause I love my teeth, but I feel like they could be a lot whiter. So, this is by Smile Direct Club. I feel like they went out of business, didn't they? So what you do is gush it on your teeth. <laughs> Happy Sunday. It is Sunday the 18th. And today I'm about to record. I got my setup. I got my setup. I got my setup. I can finally film a proper wig tutorial. Well, a proper wig install, Lord. I haven't done this in so long. About to film a wig tutorial or whatever. This is how my head. <laughs> Look, I still got my cap on from my quick wig. Pixie. Like, I don't know, like a cute little. Would I be cute with a pixie? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if she's. I don't. I don't know. Like this low key. Hold on. Let's see. But let me stop playing. I'm just finna brush all this back. It looks a mess. But I ripped my, my weave out last night. And now I got this wear and go wig I got to put on. I wonder what their requirements are, being that they want me to wear it up. It's going to be very interesting. But I'm just super excited. So I don't really have much planned for today. Sierra's about to come over. We probably not going to do nothing. We just going to parlay, kick it, and talk. I want her to see the room. So I told her, come over here this weekend. Because ah. <laughs> I really see her, but I guess since I'm going to be sticking around a little bit longer, I could spend more time with my friends. I'm about to hook this up to my mirror. I don't know if it's the right one. I got two. I think this is the one that I used. And, uh... I feel like a kid in our backyard. My mama said that it was a little boy, like they let a ball go behind our fence and they didn't come to the door. People was home, they didn't come to the door. They went right in our backyard. I think that's very freaking rude. Talk to y'all a little bit later. <laughs> Head out to a nail appointment. This will probably be the last day of the vlog. I have really high energy. It's the last day of my cycle, so that's probably why, but I got my hair out because I watched them blow dry it last night. I'm getting braids tomorrow. Um, I ain't gonna tell you. My nail appointment. 11.06. I gotta be there at 12. She's approximately 30 minutes away. You remember because I don't book on the site. So I'm gonna text her and let her know I'm on the way at 11.30. I'm in a really good mood today. I don't wanna put any product on my hair. But 
Ugh. Can I pull a little edge down? Or do I look crazy? Tell me if I look crazy. Cause do I look crazy? I think. Mm -mm. No, ma'am. No, mother fucking ma'am. I'm just gonna put it, pull it all back. I think that looks a little more neater. Concealed. Spot, 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 spot. Nothing too mage because I don't got a lot going on today. Let's be giving like, I'm cold. I'm cold. I'm cold. So, I'm gonna put a little something, something to the brows because I'm kind of missing a little bit. I really want to get my brows microbladed, but I don't even know where to really start with that. So my time got pushed back to 1230 versus 12. So I guess I have a little extra time to make my smoothie. I love these smoothies because they come prepackaged and portioned. And this is sugar-free juice. is on nine it's supposed to be on like 47 maybe so i'm about to stop and put some air in my tire because yeah i need that but i'm just a freaking girl like So my camera died on me. I thought I had another battery, but obviously I left it sitting on my vanity. These are how my nails came out. I got an overlay. Hopefully by the time I go back, they be done grew out or I want to try gel X because they're cute, but they're super, super short. They're like nubs, but I mean, I mean, they look really clean and I said I want a natural look. But maybe if they came like right to my fingertips. So I'm going to see how much they grow in the next two weeks. I plan on having like a slumber party. So if they haven't grew that much by then, I'm probably going to get gel X. I'll get my hair done tomorrow. So I was going to come home and work out. But I don't feel like I'm just be honest. I'm going to just start all that when I get back home on Thursday. Well, when I get back home Wednesday. But I don't know if I want to close this vlog or what. I feel like I haven't done much. But I don't want to continue this because I got a lot of other stuff that I'm doing in my next vlog. So, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, damn room. The only thing I like about that lens is, though, it's pretty wide. But it doesn't have, like, the blurred background. So, I want to buy a new lens. It's a Sigma lens. That shit just high. I have not talked to y'all all day. But, look at my hair. I got Alicia Keys braids. I just love when my hair is braided like in these slick bags. I just feel like my face just looks so clean. You see all my features like. I'm getting ready to pack. I should have been did this. Nothing major. I'm going to Miami. My mother is getting some dental work done and she wants someone to go with her for her first appointment so i'm going um atlanta airport is doing construction per the huge it's all it seems like they're always doing something new to that airport so we have to be there three hours ahead versus two so we're leaving out at 3 a.m because our flight is at eight so 
I'm kind of up. I'm waiting on if I want to go to sleep or just go ahead and stay awake because I feel like if I go to sleep, it's going to make me more tired and then I'm going to have to drive for two hours. So I don't know exactly what I want to do. I still need to pack my bag. I'm not packing like no bits because it's literally like a turnaround. We're going tomorrow and then we're coming back. Tomorrow is tomorrow's Wednesday and then we're coming back Thursday morning. Our flight is like 10 a.m. Thursday, so I really, it's not like no parlay type of trip. It's more of like a get in and get out. So I just park, I'm just packing like one outfit, a pair of pajamas, um, probably not even no makeup for real. Because, like I said, it's nothing major. I'm going to try and get like some work done. Me and Keisha are on this challenge starting in March, so... I need to go ahead and get my schedule together like for March and the next upcoming weeks. But aside from that, that's pretty much it. I think I'm gonna just continue this vlog up until I get back and then post this on Thursday. I'm gonna try and be editing already and that way I can just add whatever's from Miami to this vlog. Like I said, we're not doing much down there. Probably will grab a bite and then go to the hotel. Especially she gonna be what, at the dentist, so. I'm going to take my agenda and all that. Try to make sure that I'm doing what I can do. Because I'm going to have a lot of idle time. And it's not like I don't have idle time at home. But I said this week I need to start getting some stuff planned. So we finna pack. Like I said it was not major. I got the braids just because I wanted braids. And I felt like this is the perfect time to get braids. Before I start like wearing back my wigs. And they are so like I am in love. And even even if I like have to do a wig, I feel like I could put a wig over this because they're so flat and they're so little. Like they're so so small. So I feel like I could put a wig over this, honestly. And I just love how my hair lays. I just love my scalp. I feel like my scalp is so clean and bright. Like I love this. So we're finna pack. I think I'm I got like an athleisure set and then I'ma wear like my grit sweatsuit. Y'all probably so tired of that sweatsuit. But it's like I be having clothes, but I don't be having clothes that I want to wear. Like I really need to do an entire wardrobe change. Is it just me? Like you got clothes, but you don't have like clothes clothes, or you don't have clothes that really match the occasion. Like I really need to find like some cute like, I, I get tired of wearing, like, leggings and sweats. I need to find some cute, casual stuff that's comfy, if that makes sense. Because I feel like all my casual stuff is, like, real, real casual versus, like, kind of... Like, I want more elevated cash. Feel what I'm saying? So. Probably what I'll be wearing tomorrow, the Balenci's with the... When I wore this set last time, I wore my 11s, but I think I'm going to throw these bad boys on. And I know we anti Balenciaga, but if I already bought it, I'm not going to not wear it. So, plus, this is like all pink. That's me. Taking a check bag. I'm just going to take my little carry-on. So, this is she. Which I don't know how this gonna work because we can't check into the hotel till four and she got appointments. So I'm really just gonna be sitting around. That's really why I said I wanna bring some stuff to keep me occupied. So I got my little wannabe Lululemon set, my glow mode. I'm gonna wear that on the way back. Some leggings. And then with my Dolce's. Pink. I said I was just going to do all pink and all silver accessories so I didn't have to pack too much because y'all know I'm an overpacker. So I was like, if I have gold, and I have to get, if I got something like a gold purse, I'm going to have to do gold jewelry. It was just a lot. So I said anything I bring, I want it to be like gray, black, or pink, or like silver. These for on the way back. Put some socks in here. JJ's what pajamas shall I wear I want the match I'm like so like coordinated like everything in my life has to coordinate or else I can't function 
<laughs> but even like it's I just I just be so amazed at how like we care about the little things. I don't know. I think I'm just gonna pack these. I really like these pajamas. These pink and black pajamas that I got from Walmart. So yeah, we're gonna pack these. Panties. Got to have the panties. A little black pair. A new pair. We're gonna grab a thong just in case. Hmm. Two I'll get four pair of drawers. I think four should be good. Yeah, four. So I got a black pair. I don't even need no new pair, honestly. I'll do. I have to be matching down to their panties and their socks. Like, okay, that's one, two, three. I'm sure not going to use all those, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Toiletries. So I got my wipes. I already had these. I got some whitening toothpaste, bar soap, body wash, lotion, small mini lotion, a small therabreath. It's really, really hard to find these, but Walmart had them. I was surprised even Target didn't have them, so I was glad that Walmart had them so I could get it because this is my favorite favorite mouthwash and then deodorant i'm sure this is solid so they won't trip toothbrush i'm missing something fragrance it's almost out got a mini body spray a mini facial cleanser a mini toner yeah i i don't really use this but this is all i got this mini so we're gonna put it in here I feel like that's all I need for real. Oh, I've been looking for my belly ring. And it's on it's in here. My little heart belly ring. I might put it in. That's really it. Honestly, I don't really need to take no hair products. Um, I'm gonna take a little bit of makeup, like the smallest amount ever, because I don't plan on doing nothing too mage. But I might want to do a little boom boom boom. So yeah. Jewelry and this little in this jewelry box so many of y'all asked me where i got this from i got it from target and it's like a travel jewelry holder i love it decided that i'm gonna wear my tiffany necklace because i never wear it and i got it for my birthday last year and it's kind of too short for my neck so i bought some extenders but they were too long but i said i'm gonna throw it on a day i'll grab my skin tint concealer this lighter contour palette and blush glossy yum yum take my yummy gloss i'm so close to 300k i'm like three people away from 300k that's crazy of course that people have dropped off over the years like some people come in they stop by they subscribe and then they never come back and I know that because I do that as a viewer. But just to say that over the years, 300, th do you know how many people that is, first of all? That is a ton of people. 300,000. It's crazy. It warms my heart for real. Like, I know I'm going to get emotional about it, like, when it really happens. Because... I don't know, I've been feeling really, really discouraged lately. But I feel like that's gonna give me my boost that I need to really do everything that I started, finish what I started to the best of my abilities. So I love that. I feel like my journey is my journey. And I don't know, everything is gonna happen exactly how it's supposed to. So yeah 300,000 which I probably won't even utilize all this really ain't gonna do nothing but like be writing in my journal and probably getting on live talking but I still want to look presentable and then hair stuff what can I take for my edges mm, all I got is this this mini I don't know if I like this that will make me throw this away 
I don't feel like it's solid, so. But I'll be pissed if they throw it away. This is $14. And this is the family size. Hmm. What can my agents possibly do, though? As long as I'm wrapping them up. It's not that hot in Miami. They're not going to sweat out. I think I should be pretty good. I might scoop some out and put it inside of something. Come out and like stick it. I don't plan on using this for real though. Cause I don't like using edge control. Not a lot cause it can get greasy. And I like my edges to be kind of soft on my natural hair. I don't like the really harsh, harsh look. It's in here. Hopefully it don't like spill out. Get in here for extra safety. And I'ma know this is my edge control. I hope they don't think there's no drugs or nothing. Cause it's literally not. <laughs> okay, so I think that's all I need. I'm not even gonna take the gel. I might take the gel still though. Edge brush. I feel like the girls who just wear their natural hair or who just wear braids, they have it so much easier. When you got a wig, you gotta gather so many products it's unreal i don't know if it's because miami is still in the u.s technically it feel like out of town it feel like you know what i'm saying it feel like just going it don't feel like vacation it feel like going to another city you know so that's why i was like like i like miami like it's cool it got nice little scenery or whatever but it's just like a city like it's a city with a beach, literally. Got the Miami experience when I went. Now I will go back now that I'm older, like I can do a lot more. But I hear a lot of bad things about Miami, so I don't know. But yeah, I mean, I'm gonna be big chilling, big chilling like a villain. Okay, so the rest of that can go in my purse. I'm about to head out to sleep because I am driving. Night sleep tight. I plan on taking y'all with me, but y'all know sometimes my mood changes. So checking with y'all when I check in with y'all. My goal is to post this video on Thursday though. So hopefully that's when y'all see me because I miss y'all. 12 o'clock, so three hours. So I need to get to bed. Bye. Morning, it's 3.14. Um, I'm about to do a little something to my little face. Nothing major though. Trying to be punctual. A little primer. A little baby nails against the world. about being in the airport and going on a plane and going through the airport it's just me but i be looking crusty by the time i get to my destination i don't know about y'all but it's something about being up in that air that make me look a little rusty dusty musty crusty i got a little hoop in my nose i never wore a hoop but I, i'm kind of liking it i saw it um, when I was going through my jewelry box, it came with my stud, and I never tried it, and I like it. About what time you leave? Because honestly, one thing about me and how I drive, I'm going to get us there. I'm going to check in with y'all when I'm probably at the airport. Wish me safe travels and yeah.